crowbar before that was 1500 kilos towing. Nice. Good afternoon, welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. I'm Matt and today we're going to have a walk around our 2012 Mitsubishi Outlander LS. First impressions on the exterior of this vehicle, it does present beautifully. Have noted a couple of tiny wee stone chips in the front bar there. Very minor and very hard to pick. With the age and the Ks on the vehicle, it is very minimal. Tiny touch up, bit of paint on the bonnet work there, just from a couple of stone chips, again very hard to pick. Coming around the driver's side, we do have a beautifully presented example of the popular Outlander. Unmarked alloy wheel, great condition, near new tyre on the front, does have the colour coded wing mirrors on there, the roof rail system at the top which comes standard on all Outlanders. Uh, on the rear we've got another unmarked alloy wheel and great condition tyre there as well. Moving around to the rear of the Outlander, nice tinted back window, is fitted with a reversing camera, does have rear parking sensors, tow bar which is rated at 1500 kilos. So great for towing. Being manual as well, which we'll speak about more when we get inside. Um, towing is, is a breeze on this vehicle. Moving around to the passenger side, again, unmarked condition presents beautifully. It's very rare we see a vehicle of this age in kilometres in this pristine condition. Another unmarked alloy wheel and great condition tyre there on the back. Moving forward, well, I can't find a mark on the passenger side whatsoever. Um, Front wheel there, again, unmarked alloy and great condition tyre. Overall, the outside of this vehicle presents beautifully. All right, under the hood of the Outlander now. Nice simple release on the bonnet latch there. Put the bonnet stay up out of the way. What you are looking at there is a four-cylinder, 2.4-litre petrol engine giving 125 kilowatts of power and 226 newton metres of torque. Couple that to the five-speed manual transmission, you will get an average of 9.2 litres to the 100 k's, which out of its 60-litre tank should give you around 652 kilometre range. All right, back around to the rear of the vehicle now. Again, I mentioned the tow bar before, that was 1,500 kilos towing. Nice simple release on the boot hatch there. Goes up nice and high out of the way. We can drop down the bottom part of the tailgate as well. So, opens the boot right up, gives it nice flat ease of loading. Now, this particular vehicle is fitted with the rear cargo barrier. So, great if you do have dogs or you don't want the groceries flying forward and getting your rear passengers there. Plenty of room in the back for uh, storing all those things that you may wish to cart around as well. Does present in great condition. A few minor wee marks on the uh, rear bit of the tailgate there, but with the aging case again, it's consistent with that on this vehicle. All right, the interior of the Outlander, quite a nice place to be. Is a five-seater and is a two-wheel drive. Now, just on the driver's door here, nice leather trim at the top. We do have our electric window switches, uh, lock button for the electric windows, lock and unlock for the four doors, and then our mirror adjustments on the driver's door here. Great condition, isn't really showing any signs of the age or the Ks on this vehicle. Moving through to the centre console, we do have a headlight adjustment, a traction control button, and our parking sonar on and off down on the dash here. Little cup holder built into the dash as well, so you can put that can of V there while you're driving along. Now on the steering wheel does present pretty well, little bit of wear and tear and fading on the top of the wheel there, but by all accounts is in great condition. We have our cruise control on the right hand side, uh, stereo controls on the left, and also our Bluetooth hands free for your phone as well. Right hand stem has our headlights and indicators, while left hand stem has our window wipers and rear wiper as well. I do have the info button on the dash here which will control our little driver display in front of me there. So it's currently telling me that we've got a 130 kilometre range to empty. Um, we can bring up our average fuel consumptions, um, settings menu, trip meter A, trip meter B, service when that's required next. Gives us information such as the outside temperature which today is a nice cool 19 degrees in Berwick. 
nice big clear speedo on the right, tachometer on the left. Now moving across towards the centre of the vehicle, you will see great condition through the centre of this vehicle on the console as well. What I will do is get my cameraman to come up for a minute, and if I just pop it into reverse, we get to see there the backing camera pops up nice and easy. So you do have the lines there, you can see where we're going, and that has just triggered the uh, rear parking sonar as well. Popping that back out of reverse now, as we don't want to go backwards into the rest of the cars on the lot. Uh, moving back down through the centre console, nice clear display here, giving us the current time, radio station and what we're tuned into, which today is the Fox FM. Uh, we then have a six disc CD stacker built into the dash. Moving down from there, we've got a hazard button in the middle, tells us if our passenger isn't wearing their seatbelt, which is always a good thing, so you can make sure your passenger is nice and safe as well. From there we go down to our air conditioning controls, nice big dials, very easy to use and rig. Coming down we've got a storage compartment in here which you could throw your phone or wallet and that sort of thing into. Another wee cup holder there and a 12 volt socket, great for charging your phone. Do have that 5 speed manual transmission. Moving back from there we've got a handbrake, a couple more cup holders and then we get into the nice deep centre console in here which has USB which will feed back through the stereo, another 12 volt socket and a nice deep uh, compartment there for your many things. We do also have on the top of there another smaller compartment, does have the wee cut out for your phone cord so if you did want to plug that into the USB and have it charged in that way, keeps it nice and safe and simple in that top compartment. As my cameraman does pan around the interior of this vehicle, you will note that the absolute quality and great presentation in here does have the leather accents around the dash, beautiful plush seats. Um, by all accounts, it does present extremely well, and I am I am really struggling to find too many marks or defects on this vehicle. Hood lining presents in great condition. Does have six airbags, so it gives a four star ANCAP safety rating. So you can be assured that yourself and passengers are nice and safe while in this car. Just grabbing the service books out while we're in here, I had a quick flick through this before, and a credit to the previous owner, this vehicle has been looked after extremely well. Now it had its first initial service done at 2,000 k's, did jump a little bit there and went to 31,000. Um, has been done at a Mitsubishi dealer, so not a, not a big issue and very early in the vehicle's life. From there we go to 46,000, 60,000, 74,000, 91,000 and we've just done one at 102,000 when we bought it into stock. Current auto reading on this vehicle at the moment is 102051 and the vehicle presents as if it has done 100,000 k's. Great condition inside and out, great box. So in summary, that's our 2012 Mitsubishi Outlander LS 5 seater 2 wheel drive in manual transmission. 102,000 k's on the clock, great condition outside, great condition inside, great books, what's not to like, give us a call today, 9907 0555, ask your friendly sales consultant about our competitive finance options, premium mechanical protection plans we can offer on this vehicle, which do now include 5 year platinum roadside assistance. Also aftermarket options that we can have fitted to this vehicle, such as paint protection, fabric protection, window tinting, the list goes on. Ask your friendly sales consultant about those should you wish you to purchase anything. That number again, 9907 0555 and thank you for watching. Thank you.